feel like I have the holy grail of weight loss, honestly. New tonight is described as a way to turn your body into a fat burning machine, promising to help you lose weight and fast. The keto diet is a high fat, low carb eating plan and is one of the most popular health trends on the moment. But some claim it is downright dangerous. And CBS 13's Adrian Moore joining us now, getting answers on the controversy that's surrounding this diet and those who say the results, of course, speak for themselves. Yeah, and guys, this diet is so popular simply because it works. Many people on the keto diet report losing as much as 100 pounds over the course of a year and having more energy and mental clarity. But while the dramatic before and after pictures may entice you to give it a shot, experts say there are some real life consequences it can have on your health that can do more harm than good. Jamie Aria is opening the door to weight loss by eating things like pizza, butter, and bacon. Sounds too good to be true, right? I lost 22 pounds in two months, and then I started teaching other people how to do it. And how to do it and keep it off, she says, is by adopting the ketogenic or keto diet. I feel like I have freedom from food. I no longer have the cravings. I no longer have the food addictions. I am learning how to sustain with food instead of entertain with food. So what exactly is it? It's a low carb, moderate protein and high fat diet, which puts the body into a metabolic state known as ketosis. When your body is in ketosis, the liver produces ketones, which become your body's main energy source. I have more mental clarity, energy, Stamina, I just feel good all day long. Aria runs Keto Club for Women, which has more than 6,600 members on Facebook. She promotes the keto lifestyle, provides support, and shares recipes and advice on weight loss and maintenance. Clients like Sherry have dropped 73 pounds. Marcy has shed 44. And I just take a wooden spoon and I combine it a little bit. She even showed us how to put a keto twist on a, a traditional cheese, right? pizza yeah. using mozzarella cheese, almond flour, and Italian seasoning for a crust. Each slice is going to have four grams of carbs versus 26 that you find in regular pizza. While dietitians don't deny keto's fast results, Monica Randall argues proper nutrition shouldn't be so restrictive. Who can turn down a peach in the summer? What about those grapes? What about watermelon? So people over time will go, I can't do this anymore. I can't handle this. And then they'll crack and they'll fall off of it. While Aria admits she's fallen off the wagon before, she says maintenance boils down to discipline. But Randall argues it's just not healthy long term. Randall warns keto can also serve up some serious health problems. A high protein um, diet with animal sources is the leading cause of colon cancer. Randall says not only can people develop fatty liver disease on this diet, but it can also be hard on your heart, lead to a dangerous spike in cholesterol levels, and increase your risk of ketoacidosis if you have diabetes. So in very specific cases, it can be beneficial, but then we're talking about the rest of us and that level of acid in our blood is actually dangerous. In fact, in her 30-year career, Randall has only recommended the keto diet twice. It's something Aria meets with skepticism. I would challenge her with that because I can show evidence of tens of thousands of people that are actually even following a carnivore diet right now where it's an all meat diet and they've been doing it for years and have reversed autoimmune diseases, rheumatoid arthritis, skin conditions. By making keto friendly meals for more than three years now, Aria says she's had no adverse health effects and has no desire to go back to the standard American diet. I am keto for life, absolutely. Now, dietitians say there are no conclusive long-term studies that show people can truly reverse certain health conditions on the keto diet, but say there are some promising results in patients who suffer from epilepsy. Of course, before you start any kind of diet, experts say you should always talk to your doctor first. And if you'd like more information on Keto Club for Women, you can find them on Facebook. It's an interesting concept. Very much so, but uh, truly, a lot of followers, they, they absolutely believe in it, and they, they say the proof is in the pudding. It is in the results. <laughs> yeah. Right. Be right back after this.